having a go. So this is your third Supreme win in a row. In a and row. you still getting a thrill out of the wins? Yes, yeah, we do. Isabel and I really get a thrill out of it, but a lot of people uh, do not understand that Isabel and I would be the only people in Australia and maybe the world, but the only income we ever get comes out of, from a border Leicester sheep. So we believe that that's the way we have to operate. We have to be very, very professional about the job itself. So, so the Supreme Exhibit um, is a very balanced, structurally sound ram, young ram, that has, it's not its first win, is it? No, it, it, he's only 18, oh, he'd be 20 months old now. He's been to all the major shows in Northern, Northern around Canberra and all those Sydney Royals. Been, and on this trip now, he's, he's undefeated. Um, and this is the third year. Um, Different, different size every year. Um, this bloke was a bit come by a bit of uh, misfortune to a young bloke was a bit keen on getting it and before the, the ram sale I decided I had to keep it myself. But anyway, he'll get a go at it again. Um, what sets this ram apart? He's been ha had several wins at Sydney and Canberra and several other shows, so what sets him apart? Well, I believe he's just... He's not a kind sheep, he's, he's very, very hard to handle. He, he'll strike you like a horse or anything, but he's an industry sheep. He's got, pe people cannot comprehend of how much wool the ram's got on him, underneath him. He's completely covered with good quality wool, in the border less for terms, but, uh, and he's got a big ego, um, taking the AI centre and he filled most things up pretty quick. Uh, but not a good, not an easy ram to carry around the country, or yeah, it can be a bit fired up. Are there common themes what the judge, the judges at all the shows like about him, as far as his physical traits? Oh, most people have different comments about him, and they're all different. But I suppose they must, if you put them all together, they must think that all those judges that have had a look at him must they all got the same opinion on him. So. What are your plans for him um, now? I'll probably run him along for a couple of three years and then I'll let the young people, the, the young um, up and coming stud breeders, they usually like hanging around the retallic sheds and things at shows and that, and, and we like to um, repay them with even just their camaraderie and their, just good to be with young people. Have you enjoyed this show this year? Yeah, I have. Yeah, I always enjoy shows. It's been a few nights out. And yeah, yeah, but after 50 years of showing sheep, you sort of know what happens and what happens doesn't happen and what you got to do and what you don't do. And How's that calibre of competition been? Very, very good. I believe the, the sheep industry um, is getting... Uh, it's really going ahead. There seems to be a demand again, a big demand of the first cross years within the industry. They, they've been proved over many years. They're coming back with a big interest. We've sort of had our best two or three seasons we've had for selling rams for a long time. 